Hello and welcome to another episode. In this episode we're going to be going over some commands for the true environment. So the first thing you're going to need to do is from the Chrome OS side of things is press Control alt t and you'll come up to a window similar to this. And from here you're going to want to head and type in shell, S-H-E-L-L. And these are going to be the various different types of commands you can go ahead and type from here and we'll go over what each one does. So let's go ahead and get started. Depending on what Linux desktop environment you use, you will most likely use one of these commands. If you have multiple true environments installed, to clarify which one you would like to start, you'll use the dash n. So for this example, we are starting the raring environment. Now once you are inside your crouton environment, you will want to use the control alt and either forward or backwards button to switch between Chrome OS and Crouton. If you are curious to watch Linux distros and versions you can download, you can type in this command. The dash R will clarify which version you are looking to install. When it comes to deleting a Crouton environment, you actually do not need to power wash your device. You can just type in this command. And where the wearing is, you just place the version of Crouton you have installed instead. Instead of deleting, if you're looking to back up the device, you'll just replace the dash D with dash B. And again, use the uh, Crouton version you're looking for as the name. In order to reinstall your backed up Crouton environment, you're going to first need to navigate to the proper location by typing in this. Followed by this command, just replace the last portion of it with the name of your backed up crouton environment. And last but not least, the most important command is going to be the update command, so just dash u. Uh, this will be pretty important when you do get a Chrome OS environment update, that sometimes it breaks the crouton environment, so you'll need to use it. As always, again, thanks for watching, and don't forget to subscribe.